Hey there everybody, it's the Heroic Legend here. I'm back playing some Dark Souls for you guys. I hope you enjoyed yesterday's episodes of uh, the new series. There are some spiders. Spider warning. Um, yeah. So, the reason why I'm here and not at the other DLC yet is to go, well, basically grab my soul. Use my boss souls right now. Um, you can only use the boss souls here, as far as I know. Just, uh, yeah, I know you were coming. You can't trick me. I'm wise now. Now I'm stronger. No, I'm not singing that song. I will sing every other song but that song. I wonder if I can pull him into... No, no, this is going to kill him. Yep, yep, yep. Goodbye, Mr. Spider. Nope. Oh my god, that cur- That, 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 ah, uh, fucking dead angle, there we go. And this is why I leave on, this is why I lock on. Because I can't hit for shit. Now, I do hope you guys forgive me, as I did state in yesterday's episodes, um, yeah, I'm gonna be adjusting to A confirm and B deny. Oh, do I have I have enough souls? But uh, Jesus, 28. But I can use it right off the bat. I can use this off the bat too. That's good. I might go grinding for more uh more boss droppy stuffy who's in the big majiggies. What are they? Ah, oh, damn it! <laughs> there I go again. I don't have any. I know the Yoshi's dropped them. That's the important part. I know Yoshi's dropped them. Anyway, let's get on to it. I showed you guys how to get here prior. Welcome to the next DLC. The Iron Crown. A.K.A. Broom Tower. Now... As I said before, I'm not going to be going through the extra part. The extra part is actually much more difficult, and I still haven't gotten through a certain part yet, even on my other character. Now, I'm going to be doing something weird. See over there? I'm not going to go over there. I'm going to go right down here. This area is actually going to be much harder, and I'm not going to be able to be using my sword for this. I might actually stick to this. Or a different weapon. I can't use fire here. Fi using fire here is absolutely stupid. Anyone who knows this area will agree with me too, because like, you are in literally the place where fire was worn. Why would you use fire? It's like going up to a freaking... I don't know. In insert funny analogy here. I'm 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 sleepy. I'm I, I'm over rested actually. Yeah, yeah. So sick of you guys. I was sick of you guys back before. Now, the gimmick here, because, yeah, each of them has a gimmick. One's, like, the knights are... All the knights in these areas, by the way, are s armored. So, yeah. If you were planning on poisoning these guys to death, no. But each area has sort of its own feeling gimmick to it. This is obviously a place covered in ash, so... There's ash everywhere, and ash corpses, which you can break to hopefully find extra stuff. And as you can tell by all the bloodstains, there are knights everywhere. See? There's one. I believe there's ones that come up from behind you, too. But, like, he doesn't activate until, you know, you step a certain distance. Oh, Jesus, he added more. And I can't run. And I can't run. Ow. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. Crack. Crack it. 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 Can't do it like I did last time? Oh, shit. God damn it. They added... And... Uh, uh, okay. Oh. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. 
You three fucking assholes are gonna be so fun. Uh, a little bit of salt there. A little bit of salt and you're going to f discover why. I hate this place. I hate this opening spot. I hate the spot until... I hate this area the most out of the DLC. I love the bosses, I love everything else, but I hate the journey there. Because the journey's the hard part. That's it. Well, okay, no, the bosses are equally tough. Freaking alone, Rame, etc. And yeah, I might actually go for one of the extra bosses here. But... <sighs> I have a great shield. I think a great shield should stop these guys. Not the rebel or the wicked eye. That's just a sad thing about the spot. These guys are freaking tough as hell. Can I your spirit? Do you have enough? I should I should be able to get these guys like this. And I whiffed. That might work. It kinda worked. But that's really goddamn annoying. No. I figure something out. And that's just really stupidly annoying. Yeah, come on, asshole. Keep being an idiot. Oh, and there and now you know why your spear, sorry, I'm just ugh, I hate these guys. The armor that they have will Well, again, I, I put it to you guys in numbers. That's not a good number. Okay, the halberds seem to have the better poise break. My Santer Spear and my Black Knight's Helper. I can't use this either here! I can't use anything! Okay, my, my Grand Lance. That's what I'm going to use here. The Lance. The Lance will be our saving grace. And behind us. No. Gotcha! Ooh! Oh, that's not cool! I stabbed him up the ass! Ah, oh, right in the sphincter. Right in the sphincter. I might actually... Let's see, do... I know I grabbed... a soul vessel. Yeah, I might go mage for this area, but I don't believe I have my mage, a lot of mage stuff. But I know after I reach a certain point, like, bows and arrows aren't going to do much. They, they, they can't really help me too much here. I do know where a couple of secret things are, and I will do my best once I'm done doing the DLC and the story to show you guys where to find the other... Um, well, you'll see in a second. Okay, the upgraded scythe, right. That's a... Uh, Maybe I should use that for now since it has, again, 35 poise break. And that might save me a hit or two. Prism stones, I can give that to the Snuggly Twins. And now we're getting to the spot I hate the absolute most. This spot right down here. Now, you guys saw when I did the DLC episode, basically, what's going to happen. Oh, well, what an object that I needed to break. This is it. Okay. You can come back to these any time, by the way, but they don't work alone. 
fucking okay. I hate these guys. I really do. These guys are the absolute worst because they. <sighs> I hate them so much. It's so stupid what they do. Their stupid axes and their stupid face. I'm gonna. Hey everyone, we're finally back. I took a while. Just uh, had to go reallocate some stats, and I accidentally fucked up big time. Uh, let's see if I can fix it though. So, what I accident, what I meant to do, was put all those points you see in faith into intelligence. Sadly, I lack intelligence, so I put it in the wrong spot. Now I'm a priest, basically. So here's hoping that with Sunlight Blade, Sacred Oath, and some healing, I can take down these guys. I've also changed up my rings, so that should add a little bit of extra damage. And hopefully lightning beats out, well, fire. Two swings! Oh shit. That's strong. And it causes poise damage. Enough poise damage to actually take them out. Holy crap, this might have been a good thing after all. I'm weak as balls though, so... It's quite the issue. But again, we got out the import we got the important thing out of the way, and that was that we needed to take out that object there. Now I can't accurately explain to you what it is. Or what this guy is either. Ow. But he's dead. Let me switch to this so I can try out replenishment finally. I actually might have had better luck if I just frickin' healed. I don't trust you. DIE! Eh, should have trusted it. But yeah, so now we can get through this area. Hopefully. Bonfire aesthetic and two human effigies. Now there is a pyromancy around here as well. Ooh, wait a tickeroony. Okay, okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. I am the dumb. Alright, alright, it's fine. Just quick. Rebuffing, even though I have the lingering dragon crest ring. Let's wait for my stamina to go back up. And drop down. win. Yeah, okay, so this works. This works out fine. I just have to be very careful. Hello, Bloodstain. This just, just, just little, little out guy. I could try great lightning spearing him, but I don't, and even... Damn, 611 damage! Yeah, see, the problem with this is that... Ooh! So, Dance of Fire and the Charcoal Pine Resin, which is good. I might be able to use that instead of the other thing. But with... Hope, uh, there's just so much stuff. There's so much stuff to talk about. Hi, guy! Okay, so now what we do is we pull this and then we cry. You'll see why in a second. Assuming I remember the spot correctly. I think my sacred oath faded. Okay, no, 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 no. Here's a good spot. Here's a good spot. So, come down here. Read the message. Monster, indeed. And then we go. Wait. 
I live. I lived. Oh god, the other buff faded. He's a jerk. Gotcha, bitch! Okay. What do now is grab this. And then we go to the obviously fake door that I missed the first time because I didn't bother paying attention to my surroundings. And now we get the most important thing. Open up. And boom boom. Which is good for our new build. This is the best thing ever though. Two extra soul vessels. So now I can try hexing and sorceries if this doesn't go as well. But I think you guys might want to see uh, this build a little better. I might make some adjustments to it though, just to help. Oh, the, honestly, the 70 in uh, this thing doesn't hurt too badly. I should switch up the spells though, like get rid of replenishment and swap out for a heal. So I'm not pining for more health stuff though. These herbs should do me fine. Yeah, <laughs> do me. Um, I believe the bonfire is right around here, so I think I'll just head there and then end the video. Why don't I have my bow equipped? Why I make a rookie mistake? All oh, right, right. I don't have the ten intelligence. I'm dim. Where's my bow? Need my bow! Yeah, always remember, by the way, as a little bit of advice from me to you. Stay away from me. If you're gonna go change your stats using. Well. Just basically. At any point, and you're, you like using your bow, always remember to base it around you being able to steal your. That's the worst thing that can happen. At least your bow is a constant source of damage. If I just go like this, yeah, I'll be fine. Uh, I would like the bonfire, please. Okay, no, no I'm gonna have to hit here. After I kill this guy. <laughs> Alright. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Long episode, I know, but that's because I had to break it up into two different... Well, you'll see in the end. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and join me in the next episode where I continue to try to get past the Iron Crown DLC.